Most schools have had to close at some point this academic year for a variety of reasons. But as News 8 Now's Tyler Job explains tonight, one local school district stayed the course all year long. When you are done, make sure you are working on any missing work. In this day and age, there's nothing wrong with trying to learn differently. I found myself struggling with doing it online and just procrastinating on stuff. It's like different because you have to just watch and not be in class. It just isn't the same as being in person. Coming back and learning in school was an easy choice for these U.S. history students. But there will be a question on Nixon. Blair Taylor High School so teacher Dessa Nixon? Carl is more than happy okay. to be with the kids every day in the auditorium. It's been really nice. Um, honestly, I mean, the, the kids need to be in the classroom. And in fact, Blair Taylor schools have been in session all year long. We've been really fortunate. Students are spaced apart during class and lunch. Hallways are one-way avenues and water fountains are covered up. Everything has had to change and we came up with some really good solutions that um, are working. Middle and high school principal Dana Eide says a low number of students have had to quarantine this year and teacher shortage has not been a problem for the district. We're here, we're plugging along, it's, it's felt good. These four right here will be your answer for number one. Carl is teaching up to 25 kids in her history class most of them electing to learn in a bigger than usual classroom. It seems a little bit more like a college class where you're a little bit more spread out and you have the big stage to be able to talk on. So just know that one. But after a while when we have been in here, it, it does feel like a normal class too. Doing homework with a mask on is different for sure. It's not usually the most comfortable thing. But eventually, you just kind of get used to it. Like learning in a new, safe, and creative environment. Questions for me? Epler Taylor, Tyler Job. You can study on, of course. News 8 Now. Heidi says that all middle and high school students do learn remotely every Wednesday to give teachers the opportunity to connect more with the kids who are learning virtual full time. But that will change starting after next week because the number of students learning remotely has dropped.